in case our audience hasn't realized already, uh, Kyle Hunter's the college football expert. Kyle's having another ph phenomenal year. I'm not going to touch college football on this show. I'm going to stick with what I know in the NFL. And I know the Bucks are your team, TJ. The Bucks could still win this game. It's obviously what are you doing to me <laughs> right off the bat? What are you doing to me in a must win for the Buccaneers to win the division? And I see Carolina Panthers on the sheet. A, a dagger. I know. I know. But you know, I think there's a chance that the Bucks win this game, but the Panthers still cover. Because man, if you look at the way the Bucks play these games, right? They're all close to the vest. I mean, you take away those two early games this year where they look like an, a different team, and every one of their wins are one point, two point, three points, five points. They just really can't pull away from teams. This Carolina defense has really stepped up the second half of the season, and the thing I'm really looking at in this game is if you can't stop the Carolina Panthers' running game, you're going to have issues, right? And the Bucks don't have the same rush defense this year. I know, I know Vita Vea is a little banged up. We'll see if he goes in this one because he is going to be – a huge piece on the defensive line for Tampa Bay if they want to slow down Carolina. I mean, Tampa Bay is 20th in the NFL line, 4.5 yards per carry. I think that could hurt them in this one, too. And then the Panthers, I mean, arguably are playing better defense than the Bucks almost most of this season. Uh, definitely lately. Bucks are keeping, you know, their team in games with their defense. Uh, but Tom Brady doesn't look the same. And you know, we've talked about that before, TJ, on these Bay US NFL shows. The Bucs are just a really hard team to plan right now. I know it's at home. I know it's a revenge game. But there has to be excitement with the Carolina Panthers, who did not expect to be in this position whatsoever. They're going to fight hard. Wish it was three and a half, boys, but I'll still take plus three on the Panthers on and the road. Again, Steve Wilkes has done a fantastic job because they have won five games since he took over as the interim coach. They ran it all over Detroit last week. You make a very important point. Can Vita Vea play in this game? Pro Bowl defensive tackle. We don't know that midweek. He's trying to practice. He's missed the last three games, essentially got hurt on the first series of the San Francisco game. They are not the same run defense without him. Go ahead. Uh, make fun of my Buccaneers. They can't seem to score. It's like World Cup soccer. Can they get to three points by the fourth quarter? of these games but man whatever happens in the fourth quarter they they turn it on they find touchdowns they find a way to win yet yet chris farley says carolina panthers on three dog thursday will be his first play all right let's move things along here in the nfl we will stay in the nfl now really for the remainder of the show on three dog thursday 